Concerning me, peeps, what's up? It's me, John D. Villarreal, the four-time national champion, joined by Paulette Villarreal. Dude, I just saw it, dude. Monday Night Raw, Brock Lesnar versus John Cena at the contract signing, and it was great there. Because, I mean, the top of the show, three-hour special, the whole situation. You had uh, uh, John Laurinaitis out there, John Cena out there. They thought they were going to contract sign him right at the beginning. Oh, no, no, no. Brock comes when he wants to come, and he does his thing. And that was, that was funny right there. And then you had like Edge coming back and doing that all, the Hall of Famer, trying to pep talk John Cena, saying he wanted to see, you know, the old John Cena and the confidence back and all that type of stuff. And then Brock comes in there, you know, later in the show, Josh tries to give him an interview and he just punks him out. Then he just does a little, little slap him in the face, whatever like that. Then Josh started talking again and Brock just threw him right through a fence, dude. And it was great. And then during the whole contract signing, Brock had his own demands. And he said that he wanted, you know, he had certain things that he needed, that he needed to be made happy, and then he'd make John Laurinaitis happy and everything like that, and he wants the power, and he wants the control, and he says that he's a star, and the WWE needs him, and basically, he wants the name of, of WWE Monday Night Raw changed to Monday Night Raw starring Brock Lesnar. Paul, Brock Lesnar just laid it all down there. They signed the contract, John Cena comes out there, he wraps the little chain in his fist, and, and you had half the crowd saying, you know, chanting for John Cena, and then half the crowd, I believe, in my personal opinion, first of all, over personal opinion only, we're not allowed to any facts, not cast any spurs, no player entertainment purpose only, please check exclaimers. I believe half the crowd was chanting, Cena sucks. And then Brock Lesnar is sitting back there in the chair, and, and, and then, you know, Brock Lesnar said that Cena was scared. I thought this was a great Raw. It sets up the whole match for Extreme Rules on the pay-per-view. And, Paul, I mean, what would you make of this whole situation with Brock Lesnar and John Cena? Well, the first thing we have to say is that as of the contract signing, uh, at least as I understand it, it's now WWE Monday Night Raw starring Brock Lesnar. Yes. So, I mean, we probably should refer to it as that. Look, this was three hours of just great storytelling. This was awesome. Everything set up for Sunday in the pay-per-view. You saw there at the end of the show, the contract signing, Brock Lesnar said that John Cena was scared. And you could see Cena looked scared, to me anyway, in that he was sitting there and you could see it's like kind of swallowing and gulping. His eyes look big as like saucers. He does look scared, you know? You're talking about Brock Lesnar, former UFC heavyweight champion. This is real. This is extreme rules. So it's like, you know, this is all out. John Cena, I'm not sure if he's ready for that. And as you mentioned, Laura Nias, complied with the demands Brock is running the show and you know he's looking for some uh, he's looking for a return to championship glory I love it I love this Brock is running the show he just took over Monday Night Raw it's Monday Night Raw starring Brock Lesnar and that's it and you saw the heat you saw the reaction from the fans you saw you know uh, John Cena showing up there I mean John Cena in my personal opinion is John Cena so scared that he had to bring his chain and wrap his fist with it can he not handle Brock Lesnar is he worried about extreme rules what's gonna go down on Sunday Brock Lesnar was talking smack right to John Cena Cena, and it looks like Brock Lesnar's in total control. John Cena, I think he looks confused in my personal opinion. In my personal opinion, he looks scared. Now what's up with this? What do you think about that? And what's Brock going to do next? I mean, what's what's going to happen to John Cena when it's extreme rules? And, and, and Brock Lesnar can just, just go all out and destroy John Cena. I mean, is he going to do an arm bar on him? Is he going to do an F5 on him? Is he going to just smash him with his fist? Is, what, what, is he going to be a double leg takedown and just bloody his, his uh, mouth again? What's going to happen in Extreme Rules? This is a whole crazy situation. Brock Lesnar just took over, my personal opinion, you know, Monday Night Raw, three hours, and now apparently it may be called Monday Night Raw starring Brock Lesnar and what's going to happen at Extreme Rules. You tell us what's going on. Give me the comments below. Please subscribe above. I'm John D. Villarreal, the four-time national champion. That is Paul F. Villarreal. We are concerned the media. Please rate this video up. Also, please post it to your social networking sites. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.